check out the latest buzz in the entertainment world. Liz and Mike from 1051 The Buzz joining us live. Good morning. 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 Oh boy. Shakira's hips don't lie, <laughs> but maybe neither does her jam jar. Yeah, I don't know. Shakira, Shakira, what's happening here? <laughs> oh my goodness. So she was married to this dude. They were together for 11 years and they have broken up allegedly because she noticed that there was jam missing from her jam jar. So she had been out like on tour doing things. She hadn't been home. She came back and they are saying that when she opened the fridge, she noticed that some of her jam was missing and she knew that her husband hadn't been eating it so she just got this feeling in her gut of he's cheating he's cheating and that person ate my jam and so allegedly she confronted him and that's what's led to the whole demise of their marriage and so much so that she even made a diss track the entire thing is in spanish we had to go and look up the lyrics earlier but when she was doing an interview she won't confirm that the jam incident actually happened but she did say she quote open the fridge to find Find the truth. So I don't think it could be any more obvious than that. Wait, 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 wait. Wow. Do, do we do we know that her that her husband did? He cheat? does not eat jam. Like, yeah, he I, doesn't touch jam. I so that's get how that. She knew. I I understand the connection, but like, is it confirmed <laughs> yes. that this, that he has cheated? Allegedly. Allegedly, that's why we're using the air quotes. Okay. She made a diss track where yeah. she alleged that he cheated on her. I so see. I mean, oh. sources close to the couple say. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I wasn't there watching, so I don't know exactly what yeah. went down, but I'm sure Fair. something happened. Yeah. <laughs> it could have been the gardener, the housekeeper, anybody could have eaten the jam, but that is Shakira. You just don't go around and bring a, a you know, the mistress into the house. Like, yeah. <laughs> They're an incredibly beautiful couple. Either one of them could have anybody they, they wanted, but that's just rule number one. I get mad when my husband eats my leftovers. Like if we've gone to a restaurant, I'll <laughs> write my name on it before. If if the other woman had the audacity to, oh, oh no, 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 not my food, not today. As someone no. who notices uh, when anything is out of place ever. Oh my god. And who gets made fun of for it? Cause I'm constantly, I'm always like adjusting pillows and I just, I try to keep everything in the same spot around here. This is the energy that I live for. I'm like, someone else out here is like me cause I would notice if my jam You guys, was a this level. is not a drill. It's insane. So like on. <laughs> Days when Emily's not at the station, yeah. you know, I'll, I'll fill, you know, I'll fill in, and you know, it'll be myself and Emma. And then if we ever have to move the set around, we have to obviously put it back afterwards. Last and prayers, you'll hear and about it's it. Just, when I get back. Yeah, it's just like Monica from Friends, where it looks the same to me, but she comes back in and she's just like, "What's different? It's different. It's different." <laughs> and then like she will move a pillow two inches to the left yeah. and be like, "It's that's better." And that's it. So everybody better watch out. Don't touch anything in my fridge. I will know, <laughs> just like Shakira. Um, okay, wait, we have to talk about one of my favorite humans on this planet. Jennifer Coolidge <laughs> is now on TikTok. And when I tell you that I heard about this, I went and smashed that follow button so fast. <laughs> I love her so much. Me too. And so her initial TikTok, she said she'd like to read a poem and she just does <laughs> J-Lo from the block and she <laughs> recites it poetry style. And it's very, very funny. And I'm not necessarily the biggest J-Lo fan, but apparently they're promoting a movie together uh -huh. called Shotgun Wedding. And so when she's done reciting her poem, AKA song lyrics, she like moves the camera and you see that J-Lo's with her. And as soon as Jennifer Coolidge gave J-Lo the okay, now I'm like, oh, J-Lo, okay, I like you. <laughs> No. Yeah, yeah well, you've, you've got Coolidge's approval. I Everybody's know. signed off. I love her. I love her so much. And uh, yeah, I can't wait to see what else she puts on TikTok. We don't have the yeah, rights to show don't. the TikTok, but it's public on TikTok, so you can go look it up. Emily but. has been practicing her Jennifer Coolidge voice. Oh, the, gosh, the, 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 floor, like the floor is yours. Well, I just thought it was fun. I thought the first thing that maybe she would do is, uh, you know, it makes me want a hot dog <laughs> real bad. But, but that. <laughs> I'm still, it's a work in progress. I'm really trying to get my Jennifer Coolidge down and it comes across a little more, it kind of devolves into like Owen Wilson. It's like a wow, but like, oh, wow. We're, wow, we're working on it. It's a work oh, in progress. I'm God. proud of you. I think that was fabulous. Thanks. Close my eyes and she was there. Oh, okay, we have 10 seconds left. We have to go to break. Oh gosh, oh. okay. Bye, Bye guys. guys. Have a great, have a week. great weekend. <laughs> Jennifer Coolidge. This is I out of control. So you can listen to Liz and Mike in the mornings between five and nine. <laughs> we'll be right back.